Through these medieval works of art, you can find key places along the route of Camino de Santiago in France, Italy, Spain, and Portugal. This is a display on Europe's most important pilgrimage since the medieval times. It all began in the 9th century when St. James's tomb was discovered and pilgrims began arriving to honor him. Years later, Diego Helmírez proposed converting it into a place of pilgrimage as important as Rome or Jerusalem. And he achieved this. His first step was to start the construction of a great cathedral in 1075. Archbishop Diego Helmírez had the city elevated to archdiocese and he had the privilege of being named papal legate, so he changed Santiago into a cultural place. To achieve this, he traveled to Rome several times and took advantage of the trips to obtain relics, a common practice in the 11th and 12th century. From Portugal, he brought relics from Sant Fructuoso, Sant Cucufato, Saint Sylvester, and Saint Susanna. At this exhibit, you can study parts of monuments Helmides visited on his trips. The majority are originals, and some, like this capital of Aconcas Abbey or this other one from Acruni Abbey, have never left France before. Perhaps the most spectacular works are these panels of Leo and Aries from Toulouse's Basilica of St. Cernin, or these columns of the northern part of Santiago's Cathedral and of the San Lorenzo Church in Rome. The exposition will be open next to St. Peter's Basilica until August 1st.